Welcome to Education Lifeline. Today we'll be graphing equations in slope-intercept form. We have three examples here, and the first example says y equals 4x minus 5. So when we are trying to graph equations in slope-intercept form, we're going to start off by plotting the y-intercept and then moving on to the slope. So in this equation, the y-intercept is negative 5 and the slope is 4. So when we graph this, we're going to start off with plotting the negative 5 on the y-axis for the y-intercept. So we're going to start off with this point right over here. And then we're going to move on to the slope. And this slope means we're going up 4 and over 1, or down 4 and left 1. So we're going to go up 4 and over 1. And we're going to keep doing that to create a line. We can connect all these points, or we can go down 4 and left 1. And once we connect the dots, we'll get the graph of the first example. Now the second example says y equals negative 2 thirds x plus a. So we're going to start by plotting the x-intercept, or 8, on the x-axis. So the 8 goes right there. And then we're going to move on to the slope. And we have a negative slope of 2 thirds. So what this means is we're going to go down 2 and right 3, or up 2 and left 3. So if we go down 2 and left 3, or right 3, we keep plotting these points, we, or we could go up 2 and left 3. And once we connect these dots, we have the graph of the second example. Now in the last example we have y equals x minus 2. So we're going to start by plotting the y-intercept negative 2, which is going to be right here. And then we have a missing slope, and when there's no number in front of the x, we, we know that the slope is 1. So we're, the slope's going to be 1 over 1. So we're going up 1 and right 1, or down 1 and left 1. So we can go up 1 and right 1, up 1, right 1 and so on, or we can go down one and left one, and down one and left one. And once we connect the points, we get a line like this right over here. Now if this video was helpful, please drop a like and subscribe to Education Lifeline. Be sure to watch our next videos on linear equations and check the description below for other helpful resources. Thanks for watching.